Good morning again, everyone. Welcome to our online class for the second session on Tuesday. Everyone, so on the second session Tuesday, what we going to study? Yes, we going to study math. Everyone, so now let's open your book on page two. We going to study unit two. The title is Lady Book. Over here, everyone. So, are you on this page, everyone? Page two, unit two, Lady Book. Okay, if you are on this page, and now before we do this exercise, teacher want to review our sign first. Okay, so here, everyone, how do we call this? How do we call this? We call it plus. Okay, again, plus. Plus one plus one, okay, and this one we call equal, okay, equal. Repeat after teacher, equal. So one plus one equal two. So that's it, everyone. So now let's look at the book again. You have the exercise, okay. So now, teacher will read for you, and after that, we try to understand, and after that, we will find the answer. Okay. So now, teacher will read for you, everyone. Unit two, lady bug. Ted puts five lady bugs in his bug jar. Ted's sister puts three more lady bugs. In Ted's bug jar, how many bugs does Ted have? All. Now, teacher will read again. Okay, Ted puts five lady bugs in his bug jar. Ted's sister puts three more lady bugs in Ted's bug jar. How many bugs does Ted have? All. Okay, everyone. So now you already know what we're going to do. Okay. How many bugs does Ted have? All. So do you know lady bugs, everyone? Do you know lady bugs? If you don't know, you can open your book, and then you will see. This is we call lady bugs. Okay, lady bugs. Teacher also put the picture on the whiteboard as well. So this we call bug jar. Okay, bug jar. It's it's a jar that you can put bug inside it. Okay. So now again, everyone, Ted puts five lady bugs in. His bug jar. So here, everyone, these are five ladybugs. You can count one, two, three, four, five. Five ladybugs in in bug jar. So this is bug jar, and this is five ladybugs. And then Tad will put these ladybugs in the jar over here. Okay, you got it, everyone. And then Tad's sister here. Tad's sister. Puts three more, okay? Three more, three more ladybugs in Ted's bug jar. The same jar, everyone. Ted's sister put three more. One, two, three, three more in this jar. And then our question is: How many bugs does Ted have? All again. How many bugs does Ted have? All. Okay. So now you know what we're going to do, right? So we will find the amount of ladybugs in this this jar. We have five and we have three, and then we put them together. What we're going to do is we're going to do the addition. Okay. The addition here. Everyone plus. Because we have five ladybugs and then we have three ladybugs, we put it together into one jar. So we do the addition. 
So now let's put the number everyone. We have equation over here and then we put number 5 first. This is the amount of ladybugs that Tad put in a bug jar. And then we plus 3. This is the amount of ladybugs that Tad's sister put in the jar as well. And then equal 8. Okay, so now repeat after teacher. Equation 5 plus 3 equal 8. Again, equation 5 plus 3 equal 8. So now we got the answer. Ted has how many everyone here? 8 ladybugs. Okay, so now teacher will put 8 lady bugs in this jar okay so we can put here eight ladybug okay everyone you got it so now we finish our exercise here okay so it is also the end of our second session for today's class as well now teacher would like to say goodbye and see you tomorrow